All right, so JavaScript suggests names. Enables or disables including unique names from the file in JavaScript suggestions. So um, before we dive into that, let me just give you a little bit of context. So there's two settings uh, that are kind of the same. And this is just specific for JavaScript. So actually you have uh, the editor word based suggestions. And this controls whether completion should be computed based on words in the document. And this is pretty much what that setting is. So the only difference is that this setting pertains to everything in general and is set to false, by the way. And this setting right here just pertains to uh, JavaScript specifically. Now, um, there is a bug, I think, uh, in VS Code, which is even if you have um, names, this setting set to true, meaning it's supposed to give you, for example, it's supposed to give you the log um, suggestion, uh, because that's a word that's elsewhere, elsewhere in the document, and it, but it's not showing up. And that is because we have um, type checking turned on. And type checking doesn't really have anything to do with word-based suggestions or name-based suggestions. Uh, I think this is a bug, so if we set this to false, and by the way, it took me quite a while to track this down, but it is what it is. Um, if you disable type checking, it has nothing to do with word or name-based suggestions. Now they show up, right? And the thing is, um, okay, so bugs aside, the thing is, the question we need to ask is, is word name suggestions or name based suggestions, whatever you want to call it, meaning suggestions solely based on other words in the document, are they relevant? Are they useful? And the answer is no, they're not. Usually, uh, I mean, just look at this example. Uh, you write, you wrote log, and if you accept the first suggestion, you still have log, which is not useful at all. You Usually what you want is the console log, right? So, even though there's a bug that uh, prevents this feature from working when you set it to true, uh, it's not really useful anyway. Uh, so, let's leave type checking set to true, because type checking is obviously useful, and let's disable word suggestion. And that is my suggestion to you.